Hello, I'm Ram Gopal from presentationprocess.com. In this edition of PowerPoint Smart Art Tutorial Series, you will learn how to create basic bending process in PowerPoint. You will not only learn how to create the diagram, but also learn where to use this useful Smart Art tool to get the maximum value from the tool. The diagram will be able to help us convert this text-based slide into an interesting diagram like this. Before we start visualizing the information on the slide, it is important to note a few points about the list that is laid down here. The first thing is, though the information looks like a list, it is more than a list, it is a process. By the way, what is the difference between a list and a process? In a list, the items may not be related, whereas in a process, they are usually sequentially related. So the diagram you choose to visualize this information should be able to portray the sequential flow. The second thing is, we want the diagram to, to be able to accommodate a lot of information, that is a lengthy process like this. Let us say, if you were to use, if you were to take this to be the slide, let me have no fill here. If the diagram you use were to stretch laterally across the slide, when you have a lot of steps, the diagram usually shoots beyond the boundaries of the slide. So it may not be ideal. The same thing holds good for uh, any diagram that stretches vertically as well. So the ideal diagram for us to portray a lengthy process should be something that bends. For example, if I were to portray visually, the diagram should be stretching here and then it should bend and then go forward and bend again and go forward. So this structure would help us accommodate a lot of steps within the slide. Let us see if we can find any such diagram in the Smart Art tool available. The first step in converting this process into a diagram is to select all the text here. Then we will right click and go to convert to Smart Art. As always, we will ignore these um, default suggestions by Smart Art and go to more Smart Art graphics. Since we want to visualize a process, we will search for options under the process tab. If you see here, most of the diagrams either stretch laterally or stretch vertically. For us to be able to accommodate seven steps with a lot of uh, text, something ideal would be like this which is called as basic bending process. So I'm going to select OK. As soon as I hit the OK button, you can see that the steps are very beautifully laid inside individual text boxes. One very important thing whenever you present information um, which extend for that long is to use custom animation. So I'm going to use custom animation here. So I select this, sorry, I select this. Go to animations and let us choose the animation called fade. And after selecting the animation type for entrance, we're going to choose the effect options here. I can choose to have all of them entering as one object which beats the purpose or all at once. I want the individual elements to come one by one. So I'm going to select this option one by one. So as you can see, each element comes one after another. So I, I click here, I talk about the first step which is personal injury and then I click the next step wherein the person gets the document from the trading hospital and so on. So this is the right way to present a lengthy process. We can also beautify this diagram by going to design, change colors and choose something more colorful like this one and choose an effect which is interesting like this one. So, using smart art, you're able to convert something that looks as boring as this to something as interesting as this or this. 
how much ever we try to beautify this diagram you cannot deny the fact that the diagram looks a bit cliche because you might have seen this diagram a million times either on the net or being used by a lot of other presenters in the boardroom that is the reason why it always helps to have some alternatives i wish to show you some alternatives of bending process taken from our powerpoint ceo packs volume 1 and 2 this is the smart art version and this is the version from our smart art pack from our powerpoint ceo pack here we start with the end process we talk about that and then we talk about the starting process this diagram looks visually more interesting than the one that you saw earlier the good thing about this is you can have variations of the process you can start from the start and go with the end and you can have multiple bends instead of one single bend and the editability of this particular um, diagram is is quite a lot so for example if i want to remove this and if i want to add one more step in the process all i need to do is to select this press control and have it here or what i essentially did is i copy pasted an element to add another step in the process or if you want a ready made solution you can go for a nine step linear process flow like this which has a bend of different kind these kind of diagram templates are created for busy business presenters and powerpoint ceo packs volume 1 and 2 have more than 1600 fully editable charts and graphics for busy business presenters like you you just choose the template that matches your thought replace the sample text and your business slides get ready in no time so creating professional presentations has never been easier hope you like this tutorial if you want to learn more such tutorials please visit us at presentationprocess.com there are more than 500 articles that help you improve your powerpoint skills thanks a lot for watching the video and happy presenting